Good morning. You are listening to Upreach, a morning devotional presented by the Church Street Church of Christ in Lewisburg, Tennessee, to encourage you as you face the opportunities and challenges of today. Let's begin this day together with some inspiring thoughts from God's Holy Word. In John chapter 15, verses 12 through 17, Jesus says, This is my commandment, that you love one another as I have loved you. Greater love has no one than this, than to lay down his life for his friends. You are my friends if you do whatever I command you. No longer do I call you servants, for a servant does not know what his master is doing. But I have called you friends, for all things that I heard from my Father I have made known to you. You did not choose me, but I chose you and appointed you that you should go and bear fruit, and that your fruit should remain, that whatever you ask the Father in my name, he may give you. These things I command you, that you love one another. I will never forget the day during my freshman year in high school when I went out to the local community college practice field to play football with a group of older high school and college guys from our church. As was typically the case, the two oldest guys home from college for the holidays were appointed as team captains. So they prepared to begin the process of choosing teammates from a line of eager participants. Not being particularly athletic or physically gifted, I had mentally resigned myself to be the last one chosen. It certainly would not have been the first time for such an experience. When the older of the two captains was given the opportunity to make the first selection, he called my name. Had I heard it right? Was there some mistake? He chose me and he chose me first. I know it was just a Sunday afternoon football game with the guys, but I was on top of the world. I had never before felt the exhilaration and the boost of confidence that comes with being chosen first. If you can imagine the feeling I just described, can you imagine how amazing it is to be picked by the God of the universe to be on his team? When God chooses you, he knows what he is doing. God does not always pick those who have the greatest skill, the greatest aptitude, or even the greatest personality. However, he always has something in mind for those he picks. There is one thing he requires of those he picks. They are to be fruit bearers. They are not to be fruit makers, but fruit bearers. Our goal should not be to make fruit. Our goal should be to know and be connected with the one who chooses us and makes the fruit. When we really know the one who chooses us, fruit will become a natural byproduct of that relationship. Today, as you begin your work day, consider where you will bear some fruit. It might be by praying for a co-worker. It might be by simply greeting someone cheerfully during lunch. It might be by leading someone to the Savior today. Share your fruit freely. This has been Upreach, a presentation of the Church Street Church of Christ in Lewisburg, Tennessee. I am Kyle Bolton, the pulpit minister at Church Street, and I would like to personally invite you to come and share times of Bible study and worship with us each week. We meet every Sunday at 9 o'clock a.m. for our morning worship, followed by our Sunday school for all ages at 1015 a.m. Then we meet again at 6 o'clock p.m. for our evening worship. We also have a midweek meeting for devotion and Bible study on Wednesdays at 630 p.m. I hope to see you there. Have a blessed day. Wonderful, so wonderful is your unfailing love. Your cross has spoken mercy over me. No eye has seen, no ear has heard, no heart could fully know. How glorious, how beautiful you Thank you.